Hey everyone and welcome to my channel. Make sure you go ahead and click that subscribe button and that notification bell so you never miss a new video or a live stream and give me a big thumbs up at the end of the video. Hey Planner Babes and welcome back to my channel. It is me, Chakisha of her lovely plan and i'm here because i want to go ahead and do a plan with me in my b6 travelers notebook uh, this notebook i am using strictly for social media website type of planning um, as you can see she's getting a little thick so i am waiting on another planner um, which will be um, fitting because she is getting real thick you guys look at her love it so anyway so I want to go ahead and show you um, my setup first before I go straight into my plan with me so before we go into this if you haven't already done so make sure you subscribe to the channel click the notification bell so you never miss a video or a Sunday live stream so let's get right into looking at my February setup in my b6 travels notebook okay so everything in my setup was used um, that I'm using is from two shops. One is from Billa Beautiful. I did get her um, Valentine's kit. <laughs> I don't know why I was keep saying Valentine. Um, I got her Valentine's kit um, with the paper. So I used her paper along with some digital printables that she gave out to those that purchase as well. I'm using some things from Shop LCA as well. So let's go ahead and get right into this. So um, here it is. I'm kind of liking it. It looks so pretty on camera. And I apologize for the glare, um, but I do have laminate reusable dashboards. So it's going to be a glare when I'm showing. So just to kind of show you, um, I have my doily, which I had that in here previously. And this is paper um, that was from the digital um, printables that Villa Beautiful um, allowed access to. And then I added the little working girl, the career girl, the boss babe here um, because her color of her shirt matched really good. And this is from Shop LCA along with this cute die cut. You know I'm loving her, especially with these pink shoes and this pink. This looks like that unicorn um, drink that they make every year. So all of my inserts, again, like I stated, they um, are all... Um, dashboards that I cut from the cardstock paper or either from the digital. Um, so I do have this C here and I left it on the plastic because I will be taking it in and out and I didn't want to make it permanent. And my planner says Lisa Mack, she gave me this along with my um, S that's later on in the kit. I mean the planner. Um, so this is the back side of the paper um, and this is the vellum that I, the acetate that I had in there already. And this is my monthly setup. Really simple, um, nothing you know major going on. I use my Simply Gilded Washi. And then I also use these girl stickers that came from um, the Villa Beautiful Galantine's kit. And I like that they have rose gold. So the rose gold alongside with the silver bows. I thought it'd be cute to mix my um, foils up. And then this little icon envelope and a little heart to indicate that it's Valentine's Day. And all of these circles and flag stickers and this um, small box stickers, this came from Sweet Caresses Design. And I have a pocket in here and I like to keep these little post-it notes. So if I need to write something on my calendar, um, I like to put on a post-it first. And then once it's confirmed, then I'll write it in my calendar. And this is the paper that I printed. Um, this is so cute with the hearts. I really love this one. Like this kit was, this kit was everything. And then this is the vellum that actually matches. It's just on clear vellum paper. And this is my week's insert. And then this is my week's insert that I use. Um, this is the week's insert that I use for my plan in the social media. And this clip came from the Villa Beautiful kit as well and so this actually is um, printed 
from the digital kit. And then I added this cute girl that came from Shop LCA. And this just the back side, um, in which I have a pocket here that I um, added. It's not added, it actually created along with the reusable dashboard. And this is just a smaller sheet of that same paper that you've seen previously. And then this is just a piece of the card that came in her packaging. I thought it'll be cute little accents to add into the planner. So here's the S along with another card stock um, paper that came in the kit. And this is the back side. And again, this acetate I already had in there. And then this is the other side. And I like this cute little post-it because this is my PR section. And I figured, you know, PR, all the girls together was cute. And this is another one of her clips here. And this is also some, um, the, that, the cardstock paper with another Shop LCA die cut in there. And this is the other side. And this is the vellum. This vellum is so cute. And it matched so perfect with the lettering that I used from the Happy Planner sticker book. Um, because I am on the committee um, for the Planner A Better Me retreat. And I found this printable for project planning. And it just simply has what the project is, your tasks, what action steps that I took, and any notes. And then lastly, this is paper as well from the cardstock set. Um, and this is so cute. These are like the hearts that were on the Geo Dreams um, cover from the Happy Planner. And then this is the other side. And this is just a section that I have with note paper. Um, and then I have another piece of the um, packaging that came with the Villa Beautiful um, February kit, well, January kit for um, theme Galantines. Galantines. <laughs> I did it again. And then this card right here, um, this came from um, as a freebie when I got an order from um, Simply Me Quiche. And this is just a little pocket card. Please excuse the profanity. And this is the back. And then I just put this came from the digital dash. And I just kind of stuck this back here. Um, along with my Villa Beautiful pen. So now that we see my setup for the month. And of course I'll probably be adding on. Typically um, I don't use a lot of. Um, I have a lot of clips that I use for my top game. Um, I don't put them on a lot. Sometimes I do it just for photos or for deco. But since I'm about to plan, I take all of that stuff out because it just gets in the way. Okay, so let's go ahead and get straight into this week's plan with me. So these box stickers that came with this, these sticker sheets um, that came in a subscription box from Simply Gilded. They are super cute. I've used a few of the icon stickers, um, but I never um, 
as you can see, use the actual sticker sheets itself. Um, I don't know why I was saving it, but now I know because it works perfectly in my tea and spreads. Um, the colors in this are so vibrant and when I say the stickers are so thick, not in a bad way, but they're really thick so it really makes it easy to peel them up um, if you misplace them without tearing the paper. And you know that when you are printing the insert yourself, sometimes the paper quality isn't as good as the um, paper that you will get when you're actually buying the inserts already printed or buying a planner. Um, so as you can see that sticker on my hand, I was having a really hard time trying to figure out where to put it um, because it is a smaller sticker um, and I couldn't really use it as a half box because of the shape of the sticker. Um, so you'll see in a few minutes that it's going to end up going back on the sheet and I'll probably save it for a later day. So even though this isn't a kit, um, it still kind of puts me in the mind of a mini kit. Um, when you get a mini kit, you don't get a lot of the full boxes, the half boxes and the quarter boxes. Um, so it actually forced you to be a lot more creative. Um, what I'm starting to realize as I get more into planning with kits, um, if you get the full kit, you have enough to literally have no white space if you choose to. Um, but with the mini kits, it does give you more white space and less stickers to waste or to hoard. Um, depending on the actual kits, um, I actually prefer mini kits just because it gives me exactly what I need and you can save in the price because what I've learned from getting full kits in the past, the few that I have bought, you end up only using like the full boxes, um, maybe the date covers and some of the icons, but you're left with so many other stickers like the um, daily tracker stickers and things like that. And if you don't use them a lot, you just end up having all of these stickers just, you know, basically hanging around being wasteful. Um, so my pro tip, is if you're into kits, um, get the mini kit. 
um, you save you some money and as well you don't waste so many stickers um, so anyway that's just my little two cents um, so right now what I decided to do is just to lay some washi um, to put over these um, headers um, because the headers are like a grayish color um, and they I didn't have an option well did I no I did have the option like the option came in like pink and yellow and stuff like that but even with that I would have still had to cover it up because not all of my sprays are that cup color so I figured just you know print it out in black and white and cover it up so this washi was a perfect fit um, and as you'll see, what I will go ahead and do is to add some um, header covers um, just to give it some more va 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 voom. Because, I mean, they were fine on their own, but, you know, I had to add a little bit of extra. Um, so now I'm just putting in my beautiful YouTube icon stickers from H Rain Designs. Like, these are so amazing. Like, at one point I was on the elaine michelle studios icon stickers and don't get it twisted i still love her stickers but because most of my sprays have been foiled based and color um coordinated um you know these um full type stickers have been life um but i do plan on reincorporating my girl stickers in there like i said don't get it twisted but these just are so good they're just so gorgeous i can't stop Keep and ha ha and about it. Okay, you guys, so this is my spread in my B6 weeks, um, and I am really feeling the brightness of the colors. Um, at first, I was kind of like, ooh, I don't know, um, as I was laying it, but I really like it. I really like it a lot, a lot, a lot, <laughs> but no, on the, on the serious note, um, these colors are amazing. Um, very functional um, and I finally got to use my H rain designs icon stickers because I hadn't did a rose gold spread and these are rose gold look at the detail on this just look at the falling in these stickers as well and my date dots they came from um, sticker bloom and I did a video um, showing these stickers 
I just haven't posted it yet, so it'll probably be posted after this one. But just look at it. Just foily goodness. I feel like the foil should be wrapped in some rich, expensive milk chocolate. <laughs> but yeah, guys, so this is it. I hope you like the spread. Um, and I will also link um, the shops that I use, um, which really wasn't a lot of shops. Um, again, I used the primary stickers came from my kit that I got from Simply Gilded, the washi as well, the date dots from Sticker Bloom, the... And let me just talk about these real quick. I know I mentioned them when I was filming. I'm doing my voice over. But these bow stickers, they come through. They are life. And I feel like I need to order more in different type of patterns. Because the thing about it is I have so much washi. I can use my washi as headers. And then just put these um, different um, foiled colored header thing about bombs <laughs> these are like header they're translucent transparent whatever you want to call it clear um but i mean it's just awesome it definitely gives you uh more pop to your washi if you're using a washi even if you got plain headers that don't have a design on them you can always put that over there i think i did that in my spread last week no no <laughs> Maybe I didn't, <laughs> but nevertheless, yeah, I did it in the first week because I used washi at the top on these and I'm like, okay, I need to break up this plain dullness. I like this one. Mm. I forgot all about this one. Anyway, so back to this one. So yeah, so this is the spread. Um, I use again, my H rain design, um, YouTube icon stickers and that's it there's no need to really keep talking because the spread says it all but anyway and i'm gonna stop saying but anyway that's just a filler word trying to make room for missing words um so this is my spread if you like it you already know what to do give me a thumbs up also if you haven't done so please make sure you subscribe to the channel because you'll Oh, and click the notification bell so you'll never miss a live video because I always do my Sunday lives, not unless I'm sick or on vacation. And you'll always be alerted to when I have a new video up and you can be the first to see it, to like it, and to comment. And as well, I will, again, remember to drop the links to these shops. If I forget, feel free to ask because you know your girl does not mind responding into the comments section and while you're dropping your comments make sure you go up and down that description box because i think i added a uh, code for simply gilded if you sign up you get five dollars off um like i think a purchase of 15 and it's super easy to spend 15 dollars at simply gilded you hear me so make sure you check the description box i'm always dropping new codes and things like that in that box so if this has inspired you as always you know what to do share this with your planner friends so they can be inspired to create their own lovely plan so until next time planner fam peace Thank you again for watching Her Lovely Plan, and I hope that you click that subscribe button and that notification bell.